And we find ourselves in one of the great football cities, Liverpool, here at Goodison Park. And here's how Everton line up. Jordan Pickford begins in goal. James Tarkovsky plays with Michael Keane in central defence. Abdoulaye Ducouré plays alongside Idrissa Gay in central midfield. And leading the attack today is Dominic Calvert-Lewin. And the starting 11 for Spurs. Hugo Lloris begins in goal. Pierre-Emile Hoybier plays alongside Oliver Skip in central midfield. And the focal point in attack today, Harry Kane. Really looking forward to this one. Everton get the ball rolling. Keane. Vitali Mikolenko. Onana. And now Gay. Calvert Lewin. Well, it doesn't make great reading for our hosts. Just look at this. It's the weakest attack in the league, and that's official. Yeah, they're struggling to create chances, let alone score goals. And I think it's a combination of many things. No cutting edge in midfield, a lack of movement from the front players, and nobody taking the game by the scruff of the neck. Hopefully it's a different story today. Romero. Skip. Kane. Harry Kane slips it through. Well, as you can see, the weight of the through ball is key to this goal, and he makes no mistake with the finish. He showed a lot of composure there. So, Everton restart the game, well aware that the pressure has been applied. How will they respond? Mikorenko, Amadou Onana. How can they prize them open now? Disappointing pass. Harry Kane. Now Son. Another perfect position to read it. Dukure. Idrissa Gay, Amadou Onana, it's with Dukure, top class defending, Hoybier, Kane, and Hoybier with it, Son, he read the situation defensively and did his job. McNeil. Excellent assessment of the situation at the back. Well, as the stats show us, Spurs haven't enjoyed that much of the ball. But what they've done with it has been really good. And they'll be happy with the way the game is being played at the moment. They love to play on the counter Oh, hang attack. on, Stuart. Big chance here. And it's in. All square again. What a match this is turning out to be. Well, here it is again, and it's really poor defending. They just don't show enough urgency to get tight or make a block, which is why the ball's ended up in the back of their net. So back underway. One goal apiece here. Hoybier. Skip. And Hoybier with it. Ivan Perisic. Now Son. Now they stop them in their tracks. And the fourth official confirming that we'll have one additional minute. Well, time is up as far as the first half is concerned. Here.
so back underway and an intriguing second half in prospect well shielding the ball admirably Well, it's great awareness of space in the box. And then he shows a lot of composure with the finish. That's a clever goal. Everton are the team chasing the game. Let's see how they fare on that front. Idrissa Gay. And now Gay. Covert Lewin. Strong play here. Promising attack this. Can he get them level? Oh, blocked it. Skip. Now Harry Kane. Perfect tackle. Moving the ball nicely, trying to carve out the equaliser. Well, they couldn't keep that sequence going, unfortunately. 30 minutes to go, then. Ducure. Now, Son. Well, they know they need to stop him. And the decision offside here. And a change for Spurs at this juncture. Coming onto the pitch, number 11, Damari Gray. Substitution for Tottenham Hotspur. Coming off the pitch, 21, Dejan Kulisevsky. To be replaced by number 16, Arnaud Donjuma Rovell. Well, the stats don't lie. Everton have had a lot of possession, but without really creating enough chances. They've almost passed the ball for the sake of it. They need to start getting it into their front players much quicker to get back into this. Gray. Onana. Calvert Lewin. Gray. Extremely sloppy in possession. And that was a very fine read. But in the closing phase, and Everton find themselves trailing. What a chance this is, Derek. Making sure nothing untoward happened. Superb tackle. Well, on the attack, hunting for a late equaliser here. Gray. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Pedro Porro. Not giving him a moment's peace. Well, this late corner could represent the last chance to equalise. First to make a personnel switch now. Who can they pick out? And still dangerous. And problem solved for now. So there goes the final whistle. It is a defeat for Everton.